right, so here we are at the National Restaurant Association. I'm hanging in the Delfield booth, similar to last year, right? And I have Marcy and Tim with me. So I obviously know who you guys are. But for the people out there that might not know, give a little bit of background about what you guys do. Yeah. And, uh, ladies first. Absolutely. Um, hi, I'm Marcy Matthews. I am the Delfield president. Um, love Delfield, been at Delfield for about 21 years. And I uh, love talking about some awesome serving lines today. So thanks for the opportunity. Yeah, by the way, this serving line looks amazing. Like, I love the signage out here. That's great. Yeah, thanks. That's awesome. Yeah, so we like to yeah, have the ability to integrate anything custom that customers are looking for to brand it. Obviously, this is branded Delfield, but customers could put different graphics, decor, lighting, standoff panels, solid surface, you know, a lot of different materials to make it really pop and making a really attractive serving. And it, it is. And Tim, tell me about you. Yeah, so I'm Tim Wilzak, uh, Vice President of Sales for Delfield. Been there about 22 years. So uh, Marcy and I have worked together for a long time. Like she said, we love Delfield. We love serving lines. So um, yeah, glad to be here. And last year we spoke about a serving line. And I hear this is the upgraded, the better version that's out. Really, we've had a, a really strong focus on flexibility in the serving lines, in addition to also making them look great with all the aesthetics, right? So last year, we were talking about some newer releases for our flexi wells and our flexi tops, which are really multi-temperature uh, units that could be hot and cold at the flip of a switch. Fast forward a year, and really, it's really taken off for us, right? Customers are definitely seeing the value in that flexibility, being able to future-proof and get those into the lines so that they can be able to have variances in their menus anytime they want. Okay, and what model line is this? So this is our Shelly Steel line. We also have serving lines in our Ecomark line and our fabrication line. Really, it's all about being able to upgrade with these different uh, options and decor, though. We can really do that on either one of those platforms. The Shelly Steel line tends to be a little more mobile, geared a little bit more towards schools and education, but it doesn't have to be that way. And then the Ecomark tends to be more of your seamless and larger, long, more permanent counters. Okay. Uh, but really, we could do a lot of the same options and decor, regardless of which one you use. Okay. So. And so this is, you said you could use it, education, but it can go anywhere. Yeah, really. I mean, there's op applications for serving lines really anywhere. Uh, we just have a heavy focus at Dalefield on education. It's important to us. So we want to have that available. Yeah, education is kind of a big deal, right? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Right. Obviously, we want to make sure, again, with the flexibility, that the operators and the, and the directors at the schools are able to make the right choices for the kids without having to be stuck in it only does this or it only does that, it can do more than one thing. Yeah, so it was interesting when I walked up and I saw it, yeah. one of the first thoughts I had was kids eat with their eyes. Yep. People always think about like just the food itself for the food presentation, but you guys help these school districts and your customers present the food in a way that looks amazing and the actual equipment looks amazing too. Right, thank yeah. you for that. Yeah, so, so can you walk me through some of the new things or the top features of this item. Yeah, absolutely. So but first, just something simple, right? If you look at uh, the Corian tray slide that we're talking about here, and then just adding a simple option like this little accessory silver ribbon, right? But right on the line, you don't have to take up additional footprint, include that rate where the kids can grab it right here up in front. And then of course, the options of the decor with the backlighting and the different options we can do to jazz it up. But from uh, the flexibility standpoint, we have our flexi wells here. These are the wells that can be hot, cold freeze. At any time, one hot, one cold, one freeze, doesn't matter. Flip of a switch, the operator decides. Well, here's the question. Yeah. How long does it take to switch between hot and cold? So we recommend to allow up to an hour. Okay. Typically, it's quicker than that, depending yeah. on the ambient conditions. 30 to 45 minutes is, is more usual. That seems plenty fast to me. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and then, of course, we have our Flexi Shield counter protector offering. Um, this is an adjustable offering here where, again, you're not locked into full service, self-service. It really can be adjusted at any time, day to day, day part to day part. It's really up to what they want to do that particular meal period, right? So are you seeing a lot of schools going back to letting kids serve their own food? Uh, on the hot side, not yeah. necessarily, but definitely on the cold, that is an option. So again, if it tends to be a day where they're doing cold products, that could be up yeah. you know, into the self-service or put it down if they're trying to serve over with hot. Okay. But the older kids in the high schools, it may be more self-service more off. All right. All right. What else we got? Yeah. So then on the other end, we have our flexi tops down here. So these are similar to the flexi wells where each level can be hot or cold at the flip of a switch. You're not stuck with it always being cold or always being hot. So that's great for that flexibility. It's sized around sheet pans, but you don't have to use sheet pans, right? You could put plates or 
fuel cups or things of that nature directly on the surfaces. Neat, neat. Yeah. So, Marcy, what's your favorite thing about this? Your yeah. favorite solution? Well, you know, Tim said flexibility, probably if we counted it at least 10 times. Yeah. So, to me, it's all about future proofing those operations and giving operators the ability to do more than one thing. So, every, you know, all, everything that's built into this counter, you know, whether it's hot or cold or frozen, self serve, full serve, to me, it's all about the flexibility. Like, I like to change my mind from time to time. And so, have the same problem. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, even if you say, well, I'm always going to use this as a salad bar. Well, until you change your mind, your operation changes. You know, I think that if the last couple of years have has taught us anything, it's all about being flexible, the ability to, to pivot, to shift, to do different things. So to me, this line is absolutely a perfect solution. And we do focus a lot on solutions at Delfield. We like to provide the solutions to our customers to help them overcome challenges. And this overcomes the challenge of space, flexibility, hot, cold, freeze. Like it's kind of all everything into one small, awesome package. Okay. Could you talk to me about customer service and how you guys handle that? Because obviously you guys listen to your customers. So how does does that look like? Yeah. So, you know, for our customers, we always, we have dedicated salespeople that, you know, if you pick up the phone and call us, they can walk through application. You know, we have a, a great staff of sales engineers that if someone, you know, wants to talk to them about a solution, they have the expertise because we've worked on a lot of great jobs. And so, you know, they may have a solution that a customer may have not thought of that we can very easily from a custom fabricator perspective, we can take something and we can say, oh, absolutely no problem. Yeah. So for us, it's, you know, the sales process is very fun because we have the ability to create these different solutions for our customers um, that are for their application. It's not like we don't have these pieces in stock. You know, we're wait, yeah. looking for the customer to tell us what operational challenges they have, and then we help them to create that great, great piece. That's great. And I'm assuming it's made in America. Yes, absolutely. We make everything uh, that you see in Mount Pleasant, Michigan. That's where Tim and I office. That's where our okay. whole team is at. Um, so Mount Pleasant, Michigan is where this is built. Okay. What does support look like for you guys too? That customer support in terms of like if they're, if they're, for some reason, there is an issue. Yeah. How do you guys respond to this? Yeah. So, you know, we, we like to pride ourselves on having a best in class team yeah. that looks like a best in class team up front, as well as in the, uh, in the event that there is a challenge, our service team is all in house. They're there to help and support. You know, we try to fix problems fast. You know, I always say problems are not like fine wine. They don't get better <laughs> with age. And so, you know, we try to fix problems fast. There are always going to be challenges. Um, but we do pride ourselves on having a premium product. So that premium product comes with a premium experience. Well, it definitely looks premium. It feels premium. And I've heard from your customers, it is premium. So hats off to you guys. You guys are doing amazing jobs. I love catching up with you guys here at NRA. I love seeing you at the school shows. And uh, just yeah, thanks, for, thanks for chatting with me today. 